What is up, you guys? We're right outside of downtown in Edo. About to show this beautiful, cute little home. Kind of a Victorian style of a place. Um, got some friends out here. I'm about to go off this little pathway. Hey, man, how's it going? How are you, sir? Where are we at today? Really cool, Carvito, Oakland Place. Buffalo okay. Actually right off Canal Street, which has got some really cool restaurants, coffee shops, things like that in a normal world. That's going to be kind of cool to go walk to. So this Our whole home to. is gated? Whole home is gated. It's on a 5,600 square foot lot. Okay. You've got a three bedroom, two bath. It's a little on the smaller side, 1,266 square feet, but it's a corner lot. You've only got one neighbor behind you and to the side of you. Really nice size lot if you ever want to do anything with it. Yeah. Um, it just is adorable. Come on and take a look. Is this is this Victorian style? Uh, this would be a classic bungalow. Classic this is. bungalow. This is a bungalow for sure. Come on in. Wow. Welcome home, baby. There you go. <laughs> to the left is the kitchen. Really cool kitchen. They did wow, they did a really good job with the kitchen, honestly. This was built in the 1930s originally. And this is a 1930s home renovated like this. And the wood, the floors are original. Floors are original. Nice. Super cute. Love the appliances. Love this color scheme. Color scheme's awesome. Oh my god, look at all the storage. Lots of storage space. Lots of storage space, y'all. Lots of la natural lighting in here, too. Great natural light. That's what's cute about this little place. It is adorable. That's the front door. Front door here. So which way you want to take us first, man? Let's this is the living area. Let's look at the rooms here. These are actually going to be additional rooms. Okay. It's a shared bathroom. There's the second bathroom right here. Okay, this is a shared bathroom. It's a shared bathroom. This is the second bathroom. So it's not the first, but the second. Correct. We'll show you the first later, guys. Let's go in here. The little room that's actually going to be the front of the, of the uh, house. So this is facing the front yard. Correct. Let me check out this closet real quick. Nice. Absolutely as cute as can be. I already showed that. An identical room is going to be just off the side. Again, classic bungalow. They actually took this and made a third bedroom out of it. Okay. It was almost like a two bedroom. Okay. And you can see from there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. about 10 by 10. It is. 10 by 8. So if I'm like 10. standing in one corner, mm -hmm. that's looking at the other side. Yeah. Okay. That's what it is. But from a standpoint, it's actually giving you two rooms along with the master. We will clean this out, I promise. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Going to the other side? On the other side to the master. Let's go to the master here. Love this backyard setup, my god. Really I'm going to take you out to the master. Really cute master. Probably about. Uh, what is it? 11? 12, 12 by 14. 12 by 14? Somewhat close to that, yep. Okay. With a nice renovated master bathroom. Here. Nice. Very cute. Adorable. Super open. Lots of really good space here with the closet being right behind here. Really. Yeah. And right behind you is the washer and dryer status. Oh, gotcha. So washer and dryer are going to be in the master bath. That is correct. Okay. Remember, How big is this linen closet? Linen closet. That's actually your, that's your, that's your. Oh, that's the, uh, that's the master closet. closet. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay. Now let's go back to the living area. Now we're going to the master bathroom. Okay. Again, it's a shared bathroom. Shared bathroom. Shared bathroom. Shared bathroom. Yeah. What is the coolest spot, which is your back here. Nice. Really cute. Welcome home, guys. Absolutely. So this, the gravel goes to the garage. Unfortunately, we do not have a key for that door. Is it open already? It's not. It's not? No, sir. Man. I'm going to try for you guys anyway. Oh. Not much space over here, but you know. All right, Clay's gonna make this. Clay said the grass is greener on the other side, y'all. The grass is greener on the other side. <laughs> uh, this, is the, this is the rest of the yard. 
Dang, right that's pretty big, dude. So I had someone who said I want to put a pool. In here. Yeah, this is pretty far. That's a nice space, dude. It's a great space. This is dog lovers, animal lovers, anybody outdoors. They're gonna love it. This is super nice. Really, really cute. They did a good job on the house too, honestly. I think so too. So I have a personal question for you. So you see how on this angle, the home is kind of jutting out. Correct. What's up with that? It's almost more the design than anything else. Okay. They decided to lift it out just slightly to give it some kind of dimension. Okay. Depth, as opposed to just being a straight flat. Okay. They wanted to go ahead and put some angle to it to make it look a little bit more unique. Okay. And that's really all it is. There's it's just a look thing. A aesthetic builder's discretion kind of a thing. Got you. I wanted to try and figure out how to make that look a little bit more unique, and that's how we did it. Is this sitting on pier and beam yes, for it the is. foundation? This is a pier and beam foundation. Okay. You will not find a slab under there, okay. which, quite frankly, in the summertime will cool your house a lot easier. Nice. Honestly, it'll make your uh, house, your AC and heating more efficient. Okay. So. Cool, man. Helpful. This is really cool. Well, dude, this was another this great tour, is, man. This is as cute as can be. This neighborhood is up and coming. One of those things that look in Edo, you can find some adorable places to live and still be minutes from downtown. What's this listed for? They're asking two seventy five. They'll be a little bit negotiable. I think there's going to be some time to figure out what to do. Yeah. But with the size of the lot and the house, yeah, we'll just see if they're workable. Okay. I think it's something we can figure out. So, All right. guys, another walkthrough by Clay and me. Houston Property Guys, we're here for y'all. If y'all have any questions about what's going on in real estate, even if you're not looking to buy or sell, even if you're just curious, hit us up. We're here to help out in any way we can, guys. Much love. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. It's a beautiful day out here in Houston. The weather is bomb. And yeah, go out there and get it. And practice social distancing. <clears throat>